The Giraffe Man is in the building, baby. Big shouts to Scott Kaler in the comments. Monster Saturday, my friends. Monster Saturday yesterday. Big seven, two, and one on Saturday. You know what that means. It's pushback mullet Sunday fun day. <clears throat> Benny here, ghostpicksats.com, the number one sports consultant in the business. Sunday, August 2nd. Here's what I want you to do. If by chance you're still rocking the pandemic haircut, take your sideburns, push it back, and rock out a push back mullet with the Ben Dog. We killed it last night, baby. If you were on any of my packages for the weekend, you killed it. NBA Saturday, 2-0 and if you're on any NBA. MLB, one win, one push. So we'll call that 1-0. and MLS, 1-0. and WNBA, 1-0. and The only losses I had came in UFC on a 2-2 event package. We dropped our parlay. Last fight of the night, Derek Brunson got the job done against us. So for the sake of time, I'm going to breeze through the recap. I like to talk about the games we are on in the recap and kind of do a breakdown, but there are too many, you know, and I decided that I'm headed to Atlantic City, spur of the moment, I'm about to head down there to Atlantic City here very shortly, that's right, Atlantic City, gonna go, you know, go hit those New Jersey waves, party on. Party on. Excellent. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, I'm going to lather myself up with more uh, hand sanitizer is more like it. Trust and believe that I'm filling up the bathtub upstairs as we speak with the strongest hand sanitizer that I have. Okay, Sunday fun day. All my plays today, $19.99. That's a good deal. It's usually $19.99 per sport. Today you get everything. MLB, NBA, whatever I'm rocking with. I'm ready to go. So now I'm currently... On a 15-6-1 run in Major League Baseball and in the NBA, I am now 5-1 to start the NBA season. Benny is on fire. Benny El Fuego. The Giraffe Man is in the building. So, let's go. If you're new to my page, by the way, well, I appreciate you, but welcome. If you're not subscribed, subscribe to the channel. Tap the bell right next to it. You get my videos as soon as they pop up. And then head on over to my Twitter. Check me out on Twitter. I don't use it much, but I'm learning. I'm learning how to use the, the old tweeter machine. It's at Benny Bistro. You can't see me, baby. Benny Four Stacks coming. All right. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, I, again, I love and appreciate y'all. I love getting up here, having fun, entertaining doing what we do, talking sports. WNBA yesterday, Sky versus Mystics under 178 and a half. That was a winner, all right? MLS, New York City versus Portland over two and a half. That was a winner. Got our wins in our lesser sports. I hate to call them lesser sports, but there's less interest in those sports, even though money is money. We'll take, we'll cash it, you know what I mean? But I'm the same way. I love our major sports. I enjoy betting and watching our NBA and our Major League Baseball play out and our UFC. Major League Baseball, we had the Angels, Astros over nine. That was my push. Nine total runs scored there. It was tied four to four. So I knew we were at least getting the, the push, but I was hoping we could get, you know, cash that dub there. But we'll take the push. So, and then Dodgers money line. I was talking to Ghost Picks Bryce yesterday and he said, Benny, that Dodgers money line play was a gift. And I, and I kind of agree with him. It was, a, it was a good win. Dodgers money line for the win. If y'all aren't checking Ghost Picks Bryce out, you need to. Bryce is a good dude, smart dude. He also has a small team of people grinding with him kind of the way I do. Shouts to Jimmy. Shouts to Jack. Much love to Derek Dimes. Hopefully we will see soon see the return of Derek Dimes. My NBA is on fire right now as well. Five and one premium since the jump, since the restart of NBA. That's not including the free plays. Free plays are now two and one after the 76ers loss on the under yesterday. Yikes. But boy, oh boy, man, my, my under got crushed. As a matter of fact, I think I've decided that I probably won't be uh, playing any unders while these guys are in the bubble till playoff time. You know, I'll, I'll look at overs or, this, or I'll take a side. You know, probably rock, rock it out that way. Got to adapt to the bubble here, right? So NBA over on the premium side. Great wins yesterday. OKC money line. They smoked the Utah Jazz. I felt so bad because I have a buddy of mine who just started sports betting. He, ju he literally just started and he won, he, won, he won a bunch of money betting in the last four, four to five days. And what does he do? 
He, he, he put all his money on Utah. I don't know. He took all the money that he won and he put it on the Utah Jazz. I could have killed him. Like, what are you doing, bro? Listen to the Ben dog. OKC smoked Utah. We were on OKC, man. And then my favorite play was the Toronto Raptors plus three and a half. Cash that win, baby. Outright winner versus the Lake Show. Wear it up. Wear it up. You know what I'm saying? Balling, baby. Sunday fun day, $19.99 in the description of this video. UFC was fun. Pandemic events have been wonderful. We had like 14 winning pandemic events before we went over to Fight Island. We will not talk about Fight Island. We will not speak of Fight Island. But anyway, so uh, uh, come back to the Apex. We finished 2-2. Two and two, Went 2-1 and one on solo fight picks. We won Bobby Green. We won Vicente Luque. Lost Jojo Calderwood. Then the parlay, we hit Emmers. We hit Holland. Came down to the last fight of the night where we dropped Shabazian. You know, so uh, what a night. What an overall night. If you were on the $50 weekend, you swept Saturday with seven wins. Sweep. You won, you won seven, you won a seven and seven zero and one if you're on the weekend without the UFC. What? <laughs> Come on, if you're on everything, including the UFC, you went seven, two, and one. That's big bucks. That's a big cash in one day. That's what my Saturdays are about. I'm the action man. Now, today, obviously, not as much action as yesterday, but the winning plays are indeed ready. Major League Baseball starting shortly, as well as NBA. Sunday Funday, $19.99. You get all my plays for today. Let's get a free play, and then I'm heading off to Atlantic City. Free play today. We're going back to the NBA in the bubble, 4.35 p.m. Eastern Time. Portland Trail Blazers at the Boston Celtics. Free play today. I'm rocking with the Portland Trail Blazers again. This time, we're taking the points, plus the points. Free play of the day. Portland Trail Blazers, plus four and a half points. I know Portland had that close overtime win over Memphis the other day. We cashed in on Portland on the money line, right? But it was close, you know, overtime, close. But where Portland is at, I, I like where Portland is at. They're healthy. They're juiced back up. The energy is there. Nurkic is back. Zach Collins is back. I think this is a huge game for Portland. Portland obviously has issues. Scoring defense is one of them. And if they want to be able to compete with the top teams in the league, they need to be better on defense. This is a big game for the Blazers because Celtics are one of those top teams. If they can manage to beat the Celtics today, we might be talking about the Portland Trail Blazers. Obviously, Damian Lillard is a bad man. I've watched him single-handedly will his team to victory many, many times. We saw him ice Westbrook. We saw him ice Westbrook last year in the playoffs. We saw Portland nearly go all the way last year, strictly on Damian Willard's will alone, right? So I don't know how much Dame could just single-handedly will his team to victory. He needs help. Fortunately for him, he has it right now. Like the team is getting healthier. So uh, 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 the injured guys are returning. Whiteside is a new presence that wasn't there last year. His right-hand man, CJ McCollum, Carmelo Anthony. Carmelo Anthony. My partner was so mad at me the other day. I did not mention Melo. Big shouts to the Notorious. But I didn't mention Melo in my breakdown the other day when we had the free play on the Blaze money line. Melo is a beast. Melo is a beast. I should have mentioned him. Shouts to the Notorious. He could still hit a shot from where I anywhere on the court. Bad man, right? On the other side, Kemba Walker is also an assassin. Tatum probably is going to have a bounce back performance after his showing versus the Bucks. But at the end of the day, win or lose this game, I'm taking Portland to cover the spread. It boils down to Damian Lillard. I'm expecting him to keep his team in the game till the very end. Free play of the day, Portland Trail Blazers plus four and a half points. Come get linked up with the Ben Dog for Sunday Funday, $19.99 in the description of this video if you want to go bigger. We got the full month, all plays, $299.99. That includes the red alerts. That includes everything. That includes everything I put out for a full month. All right? As always, good luck. God bless. Grand on, baby. Cheers.